channel Dashnat. I am Dashan and today I am going to prepare some clay bangles and some clay rings for you guys using this molded clay and these markers. So let's get started with this video. Guys, after running a big search operation in my home, I have taken few things that I think are of same size as my wrist and my finger. These are a hemisphere, a glass, a marker and a whitener. Actually, even these are not my perfect size except this hemisphere. What I need to do is I just need to mold this molded clay and unwind it around these things and leave it for drying. To make all these bangles and rings all the bangles and rings are not going to be same for some of these i just rolled the clay and then surrounded it around the marker or hemisphere but for others i spread the clay and then rewinded it one of the bangles is having some kind of spiral pattern which is looking somewhat like coil and two of the rings are having snake like pattern so these all are not going to be same these are of different shapes and of different patterns and styles after surrounding it around these things i am also making sure to merge this joint by smoothing it using water and then after wrapping the clay in shape of bangles and rings around all these things i have to leave it for drying for some time guys i just realized that this blue light is ruining the video so i am turning it off now and going to use this gesso in the next part of this video first of all let us take off all these bangles and rings it's a very risky part now using sandpaper i am going to make the edges of these bangles and rings smoother uh, and i am trying to make them even it is really boring process guys so i don't think that i am going to complete it properly because it's taking too much time guys now i can you know relate with those people who make sculptures or are car painters they work really hard cuz this kind of things take too much time to complete and the process is really slow so they people are really having a lot of patience now i am going to apply gesso on all these and then we leave all these for drying guys look at my fingers i'm not supposed to paint my hands but my fingers are like i have dipped these in gesso this is happening to me for the second time for the first time uh this happened to me when i did finger painting challenge have you seen that video in which i painted shiva using fingers if you have not seen that video then click on the i button and check out that video also that was amazing as the gesso is dried up now so using acrylic paint markers i am going to paint different patterns and designs on all these bangles and rings guys working with clay or trying this kind of stuff is really not in my comfort zone i am more into painting and that also in realistic painting and oil paintings so i am stepping out of my comfort zone and trying new things on this channel for you people and i think i deserve your subscribe for this so please subscribe this channel cuz you can motivate me to create more stuff for you guys so subscribe i don't know why i am so obsessed with the so many colors and this lined pattern and also i am too obsessed with the evil eye today so i am going to paint it on some of my bangles and uh, on some of my rings and i am going to surround this evil eye design with beautiful patterns i am also going to use acrylic paints because these acrylic markers are really slow guys these are taking too much time so i am using brushes to make the process easier and faster for me and also i am going to paint an indian lady with three pots on a bangle and also planning to paint buddha and evil eye on this yellow bangle after getting dried up 
and after painting everything all the rings and bangles i am going to apply a layer of glazed varnish on all these cuties which is going to protect these from getting ruined and guys now be ready to see the final result so guys i am done with this so this is the result of rings this is kind of disaster cause these are not fitting me but it's okay these are really looking cute and these two are my favorite one especially this one this one is really cute ring and i am definitely going to use this in the future and this one too so these two are my favorite ones and uh, these i have to give some one and guys about these bangles in case of bangle something happened wrong this bangle is of loose size but this is kind of good design i also prepared evla here and try to paint buddha here but uh, i failed to some extent but this bangle is kind of really looking good and this bangle is kind of disaster in which i try to prepare indian lady but uh, the shape of this bangle is not even so this is not looking that good and this bangle is having very good design as you can see but in this case i did a mistake which is uh, this joint is visible here which is making it look bad but uh, it's okay for the first time try and i really like this bangle this bangle is really working for me and i am definitely going to use this bangle in the future so guys i hope you like this video if you like then press the like button and what do you think about these bangles and these rings do let me know in the comment section i am waiting for your comments and guys if you have not subscribed this channel yet do subscribe this channel now for more creative art videos i'll meet in the next video till then bye bye take care you are amazing and thank you so much for supporting me in this art journey bye